shown in a rectum style system of knots and bolts, which makes it very easy to build something like this very quickly. And the fact they actually have several designs already made to use its large number of servos. And they use the servos for the most they can. In this model, they actually have 18 servos. This design has three in each leg and there's six legs, so that's a total of 18. And on the front of each of these two robots, there's a distance sensor that uses infrared light to detect the distance of the nearest object in the rotor, along with a, another IR sensor, a much shorter range one out of the bottom, which detects this black ring going on the edge of the game area. And you know, here I'll give a demonstration of how it can find an object and chase it. The, the way it walks is very interesting because most robots in the sumo type of competition use wheels to find and move around the game area.